Super Formula 2023. Motegi News. Moving driver causes shocking Motegi crash. Liam Lawson's car caused a multi-car crash on the opening lap of Sunday's Motegi Super Formula race. With two cars airborne after colliding into the back of Lawson's car. Red Bull Jr. Lawson spun exit in turn two while challenging teammate Tomoki Najiri for the lead around the outside, triggering a major incident that sent the cars of Yuhi Sakiguchi and Tadashi Makino airborne. The red flags were shown soon afterwards, but Lawson was able to drive back to the pits despite his moving machine sustaining heavy rear-end damage. In approximately 30 minutes, the number 15 crew was able to repair the car and allow Lawson to rejoin at the tail end of the field, although he was given a drive-through penalty for the car being worked on during the stoppage. A New Zealander, who finally finished out at the points in 13th, was wowed by the speed at which his mechanics worked to get him back into the race. There was a lot of damage, the suspension was broken, the whole rear wing was gone, the rear crash structure was damaged. We had the car running 30 seconds, maybe 20 seconds before the green flag. We knew we would get a penalty, but there was a chance of rain or a safety car, so we didn't want to give up. Liam was missing some rear stability as the car was not completely fixed, but his lap times on used tires were very good. After the 20th of August Motegi incident. It remains to be seen whether Lawson will be given a fresh mark for the doubleheader finale at Suzuka from 27 to 29 October. He is currently in second position 8 points back, will he return from F1 to challenge his teammate for championship victory? Liam Lawson has since finished 13th on his F1 GP debut with Red Bull Junior Team Alpha Tauri at the 2023 Dutch F1 GP equaling Daniel Ricciardo's best finish this season. Thanks legends and I hope you are all well. Don't miss a moment from the sports that you follow. Help us to bring you the best content possible. Please share, like, and subscribe.